Hey everyone, how are you doing? I wanted to shoot a video and say, hey, what up? Um, I've had a very busy start to the month and today a couple of, I did a couple of podcasts and it just got me thinking about how hmm, grateful and privileged I am to be in this space, to do what I'm doing in blockchain which is educating, promoting, inspiring, and leading others to new opportunities, ultimately, and connecting people with good people. And um, as many of us in this space are aware of, and those who are not um, in this space, but may still be aware of what I'm about to say, <laughs> is um, NFTs, non-fungible tokens. Every time I speak to a new uh, interviewee for my podcast or a guest speaker on my events, my flagship monthly events, um, which the next one is uh, Wednesday the 21st of July. <laughs> I forgot what month it was then. And... Um, we have two awesome speakers for that, but I'll touch on that in just a moment. Uh, so, yes, yeah, so that's in basically two weeks time. So put it in your diary. It's the last one for uh, the summer. So there will be no event in August. And the next event will be in September, which will actually be my second year anniversary. <laughs> um, I still can't believe it's two years already, but. It is. <laughs> so um, we've got a huge number of things planned, a number of announcements in the pipeline that I'm really excited and looking forward to share with you all um, in all in due course, of course. But anyway, going back to what I was saying, so NFTs, non-fungible tokens. Every time I speak to guest speakers or um, people on my po podcast, interviewees, I'm just reminded of how exciting this space is. But of course, just because it's exciting for me and a number of others doesn't mean it's going to be exciting for you. Some people will come into this space simply because they want to create wealth. They're interested in making money and that's it. You know, and that's their prerogative. There's some people who come into this space because they want to make a difference. There's some people who come into this space by accident um, rather than on purpose and they decide they want to create something in this space um, and they really love the social impact. Of course, there are so many things that need to be um, highlighted, um, that need to be rectified, uh, regulation, interoperability, scalability. There's so many things in this space that needs to be looked at, that needs to be improved upon. But that's what makes it exciting as well. And also that's what makes it opp opportunistic as well. Um, but right now, if I'm honest with you, I'm just so excited about NFTs. The more that I speak to people in this space, um, just Monday I spoke to Irina from Polkadot, the Western Ambassador for Polkadot, which is a, a blockchain protocol. And she was just talking about um, their new um, NFT platform called uh, Unique and some of the um, features that's going to have and the way that NFTs are going to um, touch on, affect, impact real estate, for example. I spoke to another lady and she's talking about NFTs and gamification. And I was just like, whoa. And just being able to merge the virtual with the physical. I was just like, mind blown. <laughs> you know, um, so I'm just so excited about the opportunities in this space. And the opportunities ultimately for each of us who are willing to just come in and have a look. As many of you will know, Women in Blockchain Talks has a ongoing campaign, 50,000 women um, in, or 50,000 more women into blockchain by 2023. Uh, we're slowly but surely, you know, it's steady, steady as you go, slow and steady. <laughs> um, always wins the race, remember that? And um, in being slow and steady, it's about making those connections, building those relationships, creating those impacts and those impacts that hopefully will hmm, uh, be pivotal to one's life in a positive way. Um, 
So NFTs, non-fungible tokens, we have at the event, the flagship event coming up in two weeks time, um, Excel, um, IXL, and she's the highest paid female crypto artist or NFT artist in the space to date. A piece that she did is worth, um, was sold for 2 million, about 500 Ethereums, which is about 2 million. That's no mean feat, guys. Um, and as a mentor always says to me, and I, as I already know as well, if you can see it, hear it, then you can believe it, believe it for yourself. That's not to say we're all out here trying to make NFTs that's going to sell for 2 million, but just the opportunity to create wealth and make a, a financial difference in your, in your life, in your family's life. It's just amazing and that's the reason why i have created um the other key event that we've got going on this month which is create your own nft most people get blindsided and stunted by the technology of oh my god that just sounds so difficult how does one do that like oh my god i don't have time to to find out you know it just seems so challenging and it's too tech oh my gosh and they miss out on learning a new skill and so I want to make it as easy and as simple as possible and that's the reason why um, I am working with being supported by one of the top NFT platforms out there uh, Rarible and they are going to demonstrate how to mint an NFT and um, we're going to show you how to um, basically how to basically create your own NFT. And once you know how to do that, that's a skill set, right? That's something that you can master and then leverage, right? Because all of these things are not going away. Blockchain, crypto, NFT, tokenization, smart contracts, they are not going away, right? Now, that doesn't mean you need to understand every element of it. Of course not. But if it's a way that you can level yourself up, then why wouldn't you want to know parts of it, right? Um, there's many changes coming in the pipeline, uh, particularly for the Women in Blockchain Talks membership. I really want to start focusing a little bit more on crypto um, trading, not trading as Forex trading, but elements of it. Um, you know, and I'm looking at partnering with a company, but, you know, I'm not going to mention their names. So hopefully that will come to pass. And if it does, that will be super, super duper. <laughs> And um, the early bird tickets are coming to an end in regards to the NFT event, which is on the Wednesday, the 28th. So it's a week after the flagship event, which is free. And of course, we also have the inside track event, which is on Sunday, the 25th. Um, so free for members, £10 for non-members. And it's a great opportunity just to come in and say, what up? I have a question. I don't understand this. I want to know more about this, etc., etc., etc. So, um, you know, if you are in my world, in my network, and anything I've just said intrigues you, get in touch. You know, you can book a one-to-one -one with me. Um, you can just send me a message. And if I'm able to help, then I'm always willing to help. Okay. So with that, being said and done enjoy the rest of your july i'm sure you'll be hearing from me in between that time but as it stands for now enjoy the rest of your july bye